The officials down in Maui and the powers that be, they are doing whatever they can to block people from seeing what's going on down in Lahaina. They have built a wall, a barricade, fences all around the entire town to stop people from seeing what's going on. They have arrested people for simply trying to visit the site where their home once stood. They have blocked the media from entering. They have banned cameras. They banned drones. They're doing whatever they can for some reason to stop people from seeing the, the true aftermath of this devastating situation. Now, luckily, we've seen some photos. We've seen a few videos. But I was thinking, since they're blocking people from getting a good view on land, Surely we should be able to see from the ocean. You know, from the ocean, we should be able to see some of the devastation. And now new videos are coming out, never before seen footage of the aftermath of these fires. And oddly enough, there are boats in the middle of the ocean. There are boats floating out in the water that have been completely you know, burned to a crisp. I find that kind of interesting. I mean, I understand anything could happen. I understand that some of these boats were docked and I guess the dock caught on fire, but you would think that you may be kind of safe out there in the ocean, but there are charred remains of boats floating around all over the place. It looks absolutely insane. But without, you know, further ado, let's go ahead and hop right into this footage and then I'll be right back with more thoughts. I want to I got a video of her. You want to see if our cars are okay? There's Dave's thing.
you know, the interesting part about this fire is that it's kind of picky and choosy on what it chooses to burn. It will literally hop, jump, and skip over certain areas and burn some things, but not burn other things. Um, I've been looking at footage and photos from the area. There are some homes in the area that are completely untouched while the whole neighborhood is burned down around them. Um, there are cars that are untouched while everything else around them is melted. There's some people who've been showing footage of like, they'll have patches of green grass, patches of unburnt green grass, green trees, green shrubbery with a melted car in the middle. And it's like, what? How did this burn? But nothing around it burned. And out here in the ocean floating around the water, we have all of these boats that burned to a crisp some fell apart. You see pieces of boats floating around and then you see other boats untouched. It's just odd. I understand that life and nature works in mysterious ways. I understand that, you know, hot ashes and little sparks could fly from here to there, especially with high powered winds, but it's just kind of weird, you know, and I, I would think that most of these boats would have been okay but that was definitely not the case. A lot of them got wiped out. But let me know your thoughts about this footage and all of this other stuff down in the comments below. While you're down there, hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, ring that notification bell, and I'll talk to you all soon in the next video.